Aaron, just what did you see in those uh, two at bats to Canna and Kemp with Chad? Yeah, you know, I, I just thought I thought his stuff was good. Probably just pulling his fastball a little bit. Did it a couple times with Chapman and got away with it a little bit, and then just you know, probably trying to climb, go more to the top, and kind of pulled it down, middle down. You know, same similar to with on the three one to Lowry that hit the ball pretty well. I think he was just pulling his fastball just a little bit, but you know, I thought the stuff was good. And and Kemp, you know, he's he's hurt us this year. Um, did you think of walking Kemp there? He's been really hot to just to get to uh, Andrews. No. Um, and what about the fourth inning, Montgomery? He he was in a, a big time jam there with the error and the double play, and he still worked out of it. Just his progression. He wanted more consistency, Aaron, out of himself. His start right after the All Star break. He said that. Just the progression you've seen from him this year. What has it been like? Monty pitched great today. I thought his stuff was really good. You know, this being his third time out now since coming back off the COVID IL, I think his third. And I, I just thought he was really good today. Really efficient. Um, you know, probably should have had two double play balls in that inning, you know, that we weren't able to turn. Um, but I thought stuff wise, I thought he had a little bit of everything going. He was obviously very pitch efficient. And um, I thought he, I thought it was a really strong six innings by him. And what about Gardner chasing those uh, balls down throughout the game? I mean, it's just the first one was amazing, but the other two weren't too shabby either. Your thoughts on those? Yeah, uh, you know, the first one I I, I thought was going to be more towards left, and he kind of came out of nowhere and seeing the replay, just seeing he was on the dead run as that ball was in the air. So really good breaks on the ball, good job of, you know, clean routes and then kind of, you know, throwing the glove up at the last second, which allows you to be as efficient and quick as possible. So, yeah, he was pretty good out there today. Thanks, Aaron. Yeah. We can go next to Marley Rivera. Um, hi, Aaron. What did you see in that ball uh, that went over uh, Joey Gallo's head? Just scalded. it. You know, I think it just kind of took off on him. You know, I mean, I think it was about 108 off the bat and, um, I think it just kept kind of rising on him a little bit, um, and he just couldn't quite, couldn't quite get to it. Yeah. You can go next to Ken Davidoff. Hey, Aaron, when you follow up a historic winning streak with with two games where you know a few more mistakes, a few fewer hits, do you worry at all about any sort of hangover effect? No, no, no. We're we're in a good. I feel like we're in a really good mental space, and and the focus is where it needs to be and you're going to hit a bump in the road along the way, uh, even when we're playing great. And, um, you know, obviously disappointing. We couldn't get, grab this one and, uh, but it's on to Anaheim now and we got a, we got a big one tomorrow, but, um, no, our, our focus is right where it needs to be. Thank you. Brendan Cuddy, please on you. Aaron, Joey's played a pretty good amount of left field now being with you guys. But do you think, or do you chalk any of that up to inexperience? Maybe not seeing no. a ball like that, or is that just a ball that it's, the play that he it's, makes? It's, it's a bullet. It's a bullet. I mean, that's a it's a great play and a great read if you make the play. No, that's he's and and he's played it so much over there and looked so natural over there that I don't think uh, not being over there a ton this year has had any factor in it. Thank you. 